talk to me. Baby, you don't know what to do to me. to go to we haven't got there yet we're looking at clearance my hair is messy this is really giving my natural hair despite my lace not being <laughs> laid right here in the front as well mom what are you doing <laughs> um, but yeah we took a detour and Marshalls is going to be next. I have brought some stuff at Ross and Burlington, some Nike stuff that I did not need. And I'm going to contemplate, like, if I don't have nothing to go, like, no shoes or whatever, if I don't have nothing to go with it, I'm definitely, definitely taking it back because y'all know I don't need to be shopping at all. So, them Nike jackets, that Nike stuff is to be de determined. To be determined. <sighs> But yeah, let me get this lady so we can get up out of here. Oh 
like girl it's the next day can y'all see me because the lighting is so bad because it's like gloomy and rainy outside i've been in my bed literally all day like i knew i had some packages come in from zara i know I know you already know that's why I'm sitting right here. But um, yeah, I already knew I had some packages coming from Zara. So I'm like, you know what? Let me just stay home so I can get these packages. Because I don't want to be out and then get the notification that it delivered. And then I'm trying to rush back um, before somebody snatches them. So I stayed home. But girl, so as I'm in here editing a video, um, the packages deliver. So I'm like, bet. And I was at like 10 o'clock this morning and I really could have went somewhere because I really wanted to go to Target today because um, my mom had got some like laundry, them glass laundry bottles at Target. Um, was it last week? Last week when I got off of the plane or whatever, we went to Target and, and they had some. I was like, oh, these are really nice. Then I end up seeing them on um, IG. You know how people make what's, what's new in Target. I don't know. So then my mom tells me how much she loves them and blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, I should have got me some. So I started to get me some yesterday, but I just did not feel like going to Target. And I was literally right there, like down the street. And I really could have went. But it was just been so rainy and gloomy. Like as soon as I step out, I just want to step out, go to where I need to go and come back. Because it's just, I feel so nasty when it's raining outside. Like the bottom of my pants was wet because my pants was dragging. I was just, ugh. Like I just felt, ugh. So I just went, really wanted to get back home. I, and I didn't even go to Marshall's. Yesterday I was supposed to go to Marshall's. Didn't even do that. Why? Because I did not feel like driving across town, sit in traffic. I just didn't. I really just wanted to come home. So that's what I did. Anyhow, um, and then today I was going to go get up and go to Target so I can get these bottles that she is just ranting about. And um, I didn't feel like it. Girl, I've been in my bed all day, just like living it up. So anyway, let's get into this stuff. I already opened up. I already opened up one because I really want to see, you know, I'm not just buying for myself. Like I be buying stuff um, as gifts or whatever. So this is the first little gift. I got my mom these pants, y'all. She's gonna love these. These are super white leg pants. I think I got me some too. I'm not for certain. Girl, do you see like the little distressness? Look how wide these are. These remind me of like free people. And you already know I love Zara's white leg jeans. My mom doesn't have a pair. So, you know, we gonna get her right. And it, these was only $12.99, y'all. $12.99, like I could not resist. And my mom had already told me to put mine in her stuff because, um, you know, I think I already bought her like three pairs of pants from Zara. Why it's been on sale? Because girl, they're twelve ninety nine, and I just, I just want her to have it real bad. That's it. I got this as a gift as well. Um, this is from the men's section. Men's section. It's a um, like a little boxy shirt. I had got my brother one for Christmas, but I got it from Fashion Nova, and it was black, and he really liked it. I don't know if he wore it or whatever but he really liked it he seemed to really like it or whatever and you know he's picky so yeah this little beige one this beige or cream is cute and um, when we went to zara i think i took him to zara once and he was looking i wouldn't say he was looking at that one but that's how i knew he would probably like the black one so then i got him this as well i don't know how he's gonna feel about this i don't know if it's going because this doesn't it doesn't really have a size it just says small medium i don't know if it's supposed to be oversized but it's like a distressed tee this was 12.99 as well and sometimes he likes like he's weird i told y'all so sometimes he likes that big oversizedness that bagginess or whatever so we'll see hopefully he likes it if not i can wear it you know i don't mind but i'd rather just get gifts <laughs> then i got him these now i think i asked my mom what was his size this was after i bought these because i'm like let me just ask her now i had some pants saved on my wish list for him because he picked something out at the store and i'm like well let me put it on my um wish list because yeah these said they ran small so i sized no they ran small so i sized up but i don't know if these are going to fit him if not Somebody gonna get into these because these was again $12.99 and I'm just not gonna take them back. Like, 
between him and my mama and me somebody is gonna squeeze in these because i'm not taking them back but they're so cute men's section i like girl 12.99 for all of this so as you can see nothing for myself not yet what is this this is the only thing out of that order that i got for myself everything was literally gifts I have been wanting this bag for a long time. This reminds me of that Jack Quees bag. They didn't even give me a duster. Oh, thank you. But anyways, this reminds me of that Jack Quemis. Jack Quemis. Y'all know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. Like, I don't even know how to pronounce it. But ain't she cute? It's a denim little brown bag. It came in pink as well. This was in the summertime. I seen this girl posting on TikTok. And I just fell in love because... Um, the Jacquees bags, if you buy it on Census right now, they're about 400 and 500 on sale. Regular price is like 900 a 1000 It just depends on what style. But I'm like, girl, this was $19.99. So, and you know what? I started to order one from Census. And I was like, but I can get one from Zara for $19.99. So, I'm just, I'm not like a name brand person. So, I don't mind getting the, I'm not going to say knockoff, getting the dupe. Because it doesn't have their name on it or whatever. So it's not really like a knockoff. But you know. So anyways. Let's get into this next one. What did we get honey? What is it? Because I don't know. Oh y'all. I had got me some of these. I had got my mom. These was This was one of the pair of pants that I had got my mom. And she was like. Girl, you just buying me too much. But I had got her these because she had been saying she needed some black cargo pants. So they came in stock. Again, $12.99, y'all. Um, so I got her a pair. And then I'm like, I wish they had me a pair, girl. Like, literally, I went back on there stalking their page like I've been doing. And they had a pair in my size. So I hurried up and checked out. What else did we get, honey? Then I got this because this was in my wish list for I don't know how long. I don't even think this is going to fit me, to be honest. But I got it because I think it was $7.99. Sis, $7.99. When I was going to purchase this, it was $30. So $7.99, sis, you cannot beat that. Like, I don't care. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't care. <laughs> I'm going to spend the money every time. And then this was the last thing I got. I want to say that this was $25.99. She cute. This was in my wish list as well. You know, I've been liking that brushed sweater look. I just love it. Now, I was going to gift this, but I just really been wanting this for a long time. So, I'm just going to keep this for myself. But I just, girl, I love it. So, yeah, I got me three things and then I got them. The last thing that I got, the last thing that I got, girl, why does this box look like it's practically open but it's not this has been on my wish list for i don't know how long y'all girl but i say i'm excited my mom said i got a problem <laughs> she said you have a problem girl y'all these have been on my wish list for i don't know how long again god just be tapping me at the right times i went on there and these were in stock now let me see if they fit because i got them in a size 10 that was that is my size and that was the only size available these are 99 dollars boots y'all these were 25.99 y'all 25.99 like i just can't make this stuff up 25.99 yep these boots were made for walking <laughs> Don't ask me what I'm going to wear this with, but it's the fact that it's a kitten heel boot. They're gold. I've been wanting like some gold boots or whatever for whatever reason. I've been wanting gold and silver and these did not disappoint. So, yes, that concludes like my little haul. I'm excited. They gonna love their stuff. I know they're going to love their stuff when I give it to them. It's cute, y'all. Anyways, that's really, um, oh, girl, that's really all I have for today because, girl, when I say I'm not doing anything, I'm not doing anything at all. Like, mm -mm. nope, and I'm calling out of work on Monday. <laughs> y'all, I've been off for two weeks, just 
living it up. I, the way I see it is you take a vacation, right? And then after you take a vacation, you need another vacation after that to, you know, get back in the groove of things. Like today, my um, alarm clock woke me up for work. What? No, not at all. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm still getting into the groove of things. So Monday, I'm just not going to go to work and then we're going to get back on track. Then, then I'll be ready to go back and answer phone calls and all that good stuff. But right now, I'm just, I'm just chilling, girl. I feel like we need to talk more. I think I be shy or whatever. Some, and one of my supporters told me um, that she can tell that I'm slowly opening up. But we always just shop together and I do like my little hauls, but we never really talk. And I remember on one of my blogs, I was like, girl, we're going to get to... Uh, you're gonna get to know me and we're gonna talk some more and just like you know I'll tell you a fun fact maybe y'all should like ask me some questions so yeah ask me some questions that you want to know and then we'll go from there because I really don't know what to talk about and yeah I think the only question that anybody has ever asked me is do I have a job I probably because I shop as much as I, I do and I feel like a lot of people think that because you have followers a whole bunch of followers or whatever that you're just a social media person and that you just make money off of social media and that is definitely not the case at least not with me like I have a full-time job and I do this part-time so yeah ask me something if it's not too personal um, I will respond, but if it's personal girl, I'm not, I'm just gonna, I probably won't even like the comment <laughs> because I am one of those that I do not like a lot of my business out. Like, that's why I don't have friends. Like, have you noticed that I don't have friends? <laughs> like I keep my, my circle like super, super, super small because once you have friends and you just start oversharing about your life then that gives people room to come in and just critique you on everything talk about you hate on you like you know what I'm saying it just it just gives people room to just come in and try to disturb your peace and I don't want my peace disturbed like I'm too grown for that like I have learned I don't know I've just grown up and I just learned like a small circle is is cool at first I used to want like a lot of friends right I'm like I want to be that girl that has a lot of friends I want to be able to you know go on, go on these girls trips or whatever but then I'm just like do I really because I have associates that I talk to like I'm a cool person like I do have people that love me like me whatever you want to call it and we talk you know like whatever like all the time and or I don't really talk to my friends all the time but you know in spurts text each other call each other and check up on each other I do have best friends and stuff like that that I call and stuff all the time but anyways besides the point I just feel like girl I lost my train of thought that quick I don't know I just feel like you just don't need that many friends you just don't and when I listen to the stuff that the problems that they have with their best friends and when they go on these girls trips and stuff like that I'm like Oof, glad I ain't, I ain't gotta go through that because I like you if I like you I don't want to unlike you because I didn't went on this trip with you and you didn't did something that just did not align with my morals or whatever then I'm just gonna be like eh. that's how I am with people like in general if you do something for instance when we went to tj maxx me and my mom we went to tj maxx yesterday or the day before anyway it was this week this lady um was standing behind this man in line you know tj maxx line be long and they be having two people checking out like i don't know what that's all about but anyway so the man was standing in front and he couldn't see the cash register behind him so the uh, lady was like i'll take who's next he didn't hear her but the lady behind him heard her so she went up you know went up or whatever I didn't like that I didn't like that at all because <laughs> that just so then the lady at the cashier said oh no ma'am I'm sir I'll take you you're next or whatever she was perfectly fine and she knew that this man was before her she was perfectly fine but said up oh, you didn't hear her, so I'm gonna go you know what I'm saying and you know TJ Maxx line is just that one little long line she was perfectly fine so to me that said if you drop $20, she's perfectly okay with picking it up and sticking it in her pocket. Like, just stuff like that. You do something like that in front of me or to me or whatever, and I, I see it or witness it or whatever the case may be, I just can no longer be a friend to you. Like, I can keep it cordial with you, you know, but I can never be a friend because something ain't right. 
something ain't right like i just i do not like stuff like that we could go on forever sis because i just have a lot of things that if your morals don't align with mine or like people who throw you under the bus especially at work i i can't i'll keep it cute with you right i'll keep it cute but if you're so if you so easily throw me under the bus and be like oh well you let her do it then we were never because i would never do that to you i don't care i don't look at the next man of whatever you're doing if you got away with it cool you you one lucky son of a you know what i'm saying but to throw me under the bus and be like oh well you let her do it oh then we were never friends so yeah girl i keep my circle tight tighter than tight and that's just that anyways because y'all didn't ask me for all of that and i literally just said i don't know what to talk about and i just went on a whole rampage because that is literally just uh what, what do they say one of my icks or whatever i just cannot and i just don't want to not not like you as an associate like i just want to keep it cute I don't want to get to know you like that on a personable level and then your true color starts showing and I'm like, oh no. Now I'm now I gotta try to take some step backs. And now you're wondering why I'm taking step backs. Cause girl, I just can't mess with you like that. Anyways, girl, that was a good talk. That was a good talk. Um, yeah, girl, I'm about to go back to bed. So I'll see y'all. I'm about to chill. I probably won't vlog for a few days because I'm literally about to just be chilling. Just, you know, unwinding, unwinding or whatever. I'll see y'all in a couple of days. Several days later. Hey, y'all. Why, why am I always... Because why? Girl, that little Buick could have ran over them pair of gloves. She literally came to my side of the road because she didn't want to run over a pair of gloves in that old Buick. Anyways, what y'all doing? I have been, I called out, like I said I was, and I literally just been laying around, like, just being a bum. I've been being a bum, basically. Um, but now I'm on my way. I got dressed and kind of, like, did my hair just a little bit, just to spruce myself up because I really feel like a bum. But I cleaned up a little bit, and now I'm on my way to this recycling bin um, because I have all of them Zara boxes. Yeah it's a mess so i'm about to pull up i think this is it y'all i don't know what this man behind me is doing because he was here he was here when i pulled up and then when i pulled up to this uh the cardboard place he pulled up on the other side of me mind you on the other side of me it's like a little park and i didn't hear or see him throw any boxes into that damn bin Cause sir, what are you doing? I just saw you throwing boxes away. Listen, I'd be so aware of my surroundings because where do you, you, and now he's following me. Okay y'all, so I have not been filming um, because I literally have been running in and out of these stores. Like I went into Target, they did not have them damn bottles that I wanted, which I'm sick of. Um, but yeah, so I went in there and came right back out. Like when I say with the quickness, I mean, I browsed around or whatever, but it was quick. I was literally in there for like 10 to 15 minutes tops because I just made my rounds. Um, then I went to Bath and Body Works to pick up my candles because I ordered some candles from their flash sale last night. So I went and picked that up. When I say in and out, in and out. Then, um, yeah, now I'm about to go. Well, I did go to Dillard's as well. I did. Yep, I went to Dillard's um, just to see their bags or whatever. And, yeah, when I say that's it. Did I mention Ross? It seemed like I did a lot, but I really haven't. I literally been out for maybe an hour. I went to Ross too. I found a robe. Um, and y'all know I have been looking for a robe since Christmas time. My mom got me one for Christmas, but it didn't fit. So I found this little Ugg robe. I'll show y'all what I got when I get home. But literally just the robe and I picked up some candles. So I didn't get much. I'm about to run into Home Goods real quick just to like see what they have. I'm really just messing around and um killing some time because i literally been in the house all day bored and i just wanted some fresh air then i'm gonna go to walmart because i think i'm gonna uh, make some rotel dip tonight i've been debating i wanted a burger but then i was like no i want some rotel dip but then i kind of don't want the rotel dip because i have been eating that um chipotle bowl so it's like do i really want to keep eating uh chips and dip like i kind of don't girl who's calling me absolutely not but yeah <laughs> 
Yeah, I came inside of Burlington and I found this cute long puffer. And then this for my mom. And then this. How cute. I'm about to try that on. And then try this one on. Y'all, somehow I found my way into Burlington, which that was not part of the deal, but I did get a really cute, that cute puffer. I didn't end up getting that hoodie uh, just because I don't have anything blue to go with it. And I started to buy these uh, baby blue joggers or sweatpants from Nike recently, like yesterday, because they went on sale for like $20. But I decided like, Ugh, I have too much, I don't need it. But the only reason why I got that puffer is because that puffer matches these pants that I, the, these Nike pants that I have, and I have nothing to go with. So if, the, if this puffer matches it perfectly, I'm gonna keep it. If not, I'm gonna take it back. Then I got my mom um, that little brown hoodie or sweater whatever you want to call it because i got her some brown pants for christmas and it's the matching top like sit so yeah now i'm about to be on my way back home i was gonna stop at walmart to get like some groceries so that i can cook tonight but honestly i don't want i don't want no rotel i do not want no chips and um dip or whatever you want to call it i don't want that no more and y'all had to take them earrings off because them earrings were bugging like for whatever reason since I've, i'm getting older i can't wear like big hoops and i love them don't get me wrong like i love my big hoops but i cannot wear them i can only wear them for like two seconds and then i take them off because when i try to turn my head they're like in the way like girl y'all yeah, wanted to come this is the next day by the way and by the way hey girl where i been girl today I have literally been in bed. Then I got up around, um, girl, did, am I getting makeup on this? I got up around what time? Oh no, I don't want to get makeup on it. Anyways, forget all that. I just got done recording a video and I wanted to show y'all what I bought yesterday at Burlington. And I bought it to go with these pants. I can't really do too much because I don't have one on the top underneath. But you see the little Nike sign? You can't really see it. But does it match? I don't know. I don't know, but this is the only reason why I bought this coat. Let me dim down my lighting. I don't think you can really get the gist. Hold on. Okay, is that better? Can y'all see it better? Like, get the gist of the color? Okay, so now let me poke my leg out. Is it giving? Because it's like that mauve. It's a little off, right? But it kind of goes. Like, that's the, literally the only reason why I bought this jacket. I don't think you can really tell on camera. I don't know. But that's why I bought this jacket to go with it. I can't do too much because I don't got the got no top on underneath. But she's cute, y'all. Why I went on Nike and why this was on Nike for, um, it was on sale for $70 and it's sold out now. It's originally $200. It was on sale for $70. Sold out. And I got this thing for $34.99. Sis, winning. But anyways, but anyways, I'm about to, and then I don't like my hair. I just been, uh, I filmed a video today too, girl. I filmed a video today too and I had not liked my hair all day. I'm about to literally take this down. It's it's a wrap for this little hairstyle. I thought I was gonna wear this hairstyle for the rest of the week and I'm not, sis, mm-mm. I'm about to take my hair out. I'm about to go take out some chicken. I forgot to take out what I was gonna eat tonight. I'm gonna make me some pasta. Yeah, let me go take that pasta out, hold on. The next day. Hey y'all, ooh, look at my head hat. We are at the store. I don't like the way my hat looks. We were supposed to go um, to Zara, but the traffic, the traffic was horrendous. We sat and moved up two spaces in an hour and a half. So therefore, we exited that mission. And now we're on our side of town 
I'm just upset because I really wanted to go to Zara. I think that's a sign that it's telling me I don't need to be in Zara because my mom told me not to go to Zara in the first place. So, yeah, now we're in it. Marshalls. I don't really have anything to get in here because this was not supposed to be the stop. This was not supposed to be the thing that we were doing. Um, so, yeah, I guess I'm just browsing. Y'all, so we're leaving Marshalls. It was absolutely, I'm not going to say absolutely nothing. They have some bags in there. I didn't really look at clothes because I don't need any more clothes. Um, so, yeah, didn't get anything, even though I did like that bag, but... I didn't need it, so I did good. We're going to Ross next, so. Y'all, if my mama don't stop texting me, she sends me TikToks throughout the entire day. It's crazy. I just, I don't, I don't understand. I sent her something of Mariah Carey's daughter singing and uh, girl, now she's writing me. <laughs> she didn't send me something else, girl, child. Anyway, I have more packages come. My mom says I have a problem. Hold on, let me fix this. Okay, she says I have a problem. <laughs> she told me yesterday, you do not need to go to Zara. You do not. Girl. Okay, mom. She told me it's not her daughter. Okay, mom. She will go. I will send her something and she will research. And if I send it to her, she'll be like, who is this? Okay, I'll find out. Like, girl. Anyways, she says I have a problem because I'm buying a whole bunch of stuff from Zara and I know I do I know I have a shopping problem and that is okay the first step is amazing anyways the stuff is good quality and the the way I do things is, uh, my second most asked question is where do I store my clothes and what do I do with everything y'all when I say I clean out my closet um I've always shopped at Zara for maybe I'll say about four or five years now and um, beforehand, when I used to go to their sale, I used to just get stuff because I didn't know that the sale got cheaper. So I would just get stuff right then and there and then leave it alone. But now that I've become in um, like a shopper shopper and I'm always shopping, I notice that the sales start trickling down. And I'm not going to say that my pieces in my closet are not quality, but you know, I am a frugal person. I do like to get stuff on a budget. Now, I'm not going to say now I do. I've always been like that. But beforehand, I would shop at places like Rainbow, 
um, which nothing is wrong with Rainbow, right? But you know, the quality is not always there. Um, beforehand, Walmart's quality wasn't always there because beforehand it wasn't a free assembly or a scoop or anything like that. So if you go back in my closet and I would get a lot of sets from Fashion Nova, like cheap little sets. So I go back, half of the stuff I can't fit and then half of the stuff is not good quality. It's not like a time piece that can carry on into another season so i have a lot of that so i get rid of every single thing like one by one i get rid of it and i replace it with my new quality items so when everybody's like oh my goodness i know your closet is full it's really not because since i got rid of so much stuff it makes room for this other stuff that i'm bringing in and it's quality now once I'm adding in all of this. Yeah, it's going to be like at a standstill, but it's a lot of stuff in my closet that I just do not wear. And again, it's pretty much like I have a lot of American Eagle jeans and I love American Eagle, but my style has changed. So I don't wear like the tight fitted jeans anymore. So like stuff like that, I didn't got rid of. So it's just like basic stuff like that stuff that I just don't wear anymore, but it still is good quality. I'm probably going to, um, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to put it in like a little sale or whatever. Some stuff I just gave to the Goodwill, but my mom told me stop giving stuff to Goodwill because it's people in need and she's so right. Like I don't want to give stuff to Goodwill and then you're uh, profiting off of my stuff, right? And especially people that need it. So there you have it, y'all. My closet is fine. I can still shut the doors. Barely but they're they're shut right the, the doors are shut i pretty much have room for everything now if i continue to keep going like i am i'm just gonna have to keep doing more cleanings you know you clean some and then keep going and all of this stuff right here from zara y'all when i say it was 19.99 12.99 it's like so cheap i'm about to say if this is my mama girl girl okay so I got my mama these and half of the stuff that I'm getting right now is not for me. It's for my mom. Like if I'm going to be dressed to the T, she going to be dressed to the T too. Okay. So we got her these, these little black kitten heels. Oh, she's going to love these. Um, I had tried to get her some kitten heels inside of the store. And she was like, no, I don't want you spending 30 if they were 35 dollars and i'm like girl please like we can get them she's like no i'm probably not gonna wear them but these went on sale for 15.99 um so and they were all and these are the beige ones they were all available in her size so you know what i did hurried up and checked out with all eight of them i mean all eight of them her size is eight but i checked out with all three of them because i'm like you know what she's gonna get these shoes and she's gonna thank me later these ones she picked up in the store the last time that we went to the store she picked these up i was gonna get these but i just didn't they're like this moth pink i probably should have huh i had the opportunity to get them when they were 19.99 and i didn't and now that i'm looking at them i'm slick jealous because i'm gonna put her together an outfit and she's gonna eat these yeah these are what i got her i cannot wait to give these to her y'all they're so cute okay so that's for her see it just makes it so much better because not everything is for me what is this honey y'all did i tell y'all that i just woke up i literally just woke up um jumped up because i looked at my phone and it said here's our packages are delivered do you know how i am about my packages i do not want them sitting outside Okay, y'all, I got this jacket for $19. See, do you see why I just be how I am? $19 for this coat. Can y'all see it? It's a nice little pea coat. $19.99, sis. Originally $100, right? Where did tag get? Originally $129. I got it in a size large because that's how I like my coats. $19.99. Like... And now do you see why I just continue to shop? Because I don't have any like peacoats like this to dress up or whatever. And if I can get a hundred dollar coat for $19.99, girl, that's what I'm gonna do. What is the gift box, child? What do we have? Y'all, I gotta finish the 
I gotta finish cleaning up. I started to clean. I need to clean out my bathroom. So that's basically what I'm gonna do today. Is just stay home and clean. I started to go to Zara again, but reading the news. Is this ripped? Reading the news is still crazy, crazy traffic. It's accidents everywhere in the city. It's always accidents. They can never drive here. I promise you they can't. But I don't know what was going on yesterday. Just stuff was backed up really bad. Okay, y'all. I have been eyeing this down. I love me a good cardigan. I've been eyeing this down. Y'all, this cardigan was $89.90. And I got it for $9.99. When I say I checked out with the quickness, I have been wanting this cardigan all um, winter long. And it just happened to come back in stock. And it's very, it's not very long, but it's long enough. I got this in a size medium. $9.99, y'all. Do you? $9.99. Okay. <clears throat> the next couple of things that I got is from the men's section. I got this little graphic tee or graphic sweat top. You know I love a good graphic sweat top. Real cute. It's not for me though. These are gifts. Hopefully, hopefully he likes it because you know my brother is picky y'all. Then I got him this one. Girl, who is Stevie Miller Band? This was $47 and I got it for $12.99. Isn't it cute? It's just real plain, y'all. Real plain. Real plain, but he likes plain stuff like this. I love it. That was $12.99 and then this one was $15.99. Yeah. Just... just my, lip, my lip gloss just got on it. Real cute, plain, simple. The um, the what you call it is killing my vibes. The blinds, but yeah, that's all it is. And you know, it's good quality. He may or may not like that, but I don't know. I got me one of those too. And now that I'm looking at it, I thought it was gonna go with my black and red Jordans, and I don't know. Let me see what's in this other box. Y'all, why do I be punching it like that? I don't know. What's in here? I know what better be coming. I have a jacket. Okay, so I got this. Now, let me tell you about this. I have bought this. It had went on their special price list for $27, and I didn't get it, and I had been eyeing it the whole time. Then I seen this girl wear it, and I was like, oh, my goodness, that says uh, Best from Zara. I want it. So I purchased it. When it went on sale for $19.99. Then I took it back because I didn't like the way it fit. Then I bought it again when it went back uh, cheaper for $9.99. Like, I'm crazy. Okay, this this I got for my mom. Hopefully, hopefully, she can fit it. I have bought me one. And I got it in a size large. And she tried it on and it was slightly too big for her. And she had told me that um, she really liked this. Because somebody on TikTok... That she watches that does fashion um had like this type of jumpsuit similar and she put a long sleeve under it and i was like oh i can wear that blah 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 i know she's not gonna wear this but it was $9.99 so i don't care if she wears it or not but it was $9.99 and it was originally um $80 i want to say yep $89.90 originally $89.90 and i got it for $9.99 so this is for her Y'all, I be buying everybody's stuff. Oh, okay. And then this. Y'all, I've been having this. What size is this? Medium? I've been having this in my um in my special little thing for a long time now. And I never purchased it. Um, and I started to purchase it when it was regular price. And I just never did because I just didn't need it. And if I don't need it, I'm not going to buy it at regular price. You know, I like to get everything on sale. Um... Then it went cheaper and it went to $12.99 and I had like multiple times to go ahead and get it and I still didn't get it. I still did not get it and then it went to $9.99 and I'm like, it came available and I'm like, why not? Let's just get it. So that is everything I got this go around. Let me put this back in this box. Everything in the box from my mom so I can give that to her. 
But yeah, bro, that's all I got for everybody. I need to put my brother's stuff in his little thing. So really for myself, I just got this sweater, um, two sweaters and a coat. So it's really, it really don't be that bad when I be shopping because I be thinking about other people getting my family right. You know what I'm saying? So anyways, I'm about to, um, what am I about to do? Oh, girl, my leg. I'm about to finish cleaning. I'm about to go clean my bathroom, finish the laundry because I started folding clothes earlier. Um, but I still need to fold, like, some more clothes. And then, what else? I'm just going to be chilling today. Y'all really never have, like, a chill day. I'm never really, like, at home, you know? Like, not doing anything. So, I'm just twiddling my thumbs. But I do need to clean up. So, I'll probably do that and just vacuum. Do I need to vacuum? Yeah, I probably do need to vacuum. And dust... Yeah, this is going to be a cleaning day. I do need to, um, I did get another package um, to do a hair review. But for whatever reason, I do not feel like putting on makeup today. I just don't. I'd be ready to get that makeup off of my face. One thing about me, I love to get dressed up or whatever. But when I get back home, like I'm popping them lashes off. I'm washing that face immediately. Like I need to, the jewelry. I can't, I can't, I already told you, I cannot keep earrings on my ears to save my life. Necklaces, after a while, I feel like I'm being choked. Like I don't know what it is. But as soon as I get home, like when my friends FaceTime me or whatever, they like, dang, girl, you just got home. How is it that you already in your pajamas? Like, I don't play no games. Like, psh. I just, I got to get out of it. Anyways, I'm rambling. I'm about to clean. I don't know if y'all want to clean. Do y'all want to clean with me? I told y'all we need to see what we are going to talk about on these vlogs. I be trying to look at other people's vlogs to see like what they're talking about. And then half of the time I just scroll through because I'm like, girl, I don't really care what you're talking about. And it don't be like, like some of the vlogs that I watch. I'm like, oh, people must really enjoy them because it's just like different scenes of them in their house and they're just like talking and I never see them like go to the store. Like, what do they be doing? I'm going to watch a few more people. I just watch whoever pops up on my, is it called a for you page? But I'm like, what do they be talking about? And then the camera be all close to them and I'm like, and then the next scene will be like, they're still in the same position talking about something else. I mean, no, no hate, no, no hate at all. I just... I'm just trying to get used to the vlogging because my channel started off as like fashion or whatever and then I don't even know how I just one day wanted to do vlogmas for Christmas and I had a couple of hundred people like I, I still don't have like thousands like people have like 20,000 people watching their vlogs I don't have that but I'm very appreciative for everybody who does watch my vlogs like I love y'all so much um but yeah I'm just like I just be trying to see, like, what do other people do? Like, what do y'all be talking about? Like, I just, I don't, I don't know. And I'm not the type of person to be like, um, I don't go to the gym, you know? I need to. I probably need to start exercising more, but I don't go to the gym. I don't go get a coffee. Like, I don't... I'm not about to go get no coffee nowhere or sit at a coffee shop. It'd be so cute, though. I watch. I'd be like, oh, okay. But I just, that's just not for me because I don't drink coffee. Um, and I already told y'all I don't have friends besides my mom. So that's why y'all always see her in literally every last single video. And she's gotten much better with wanting to be on camera because before she did not want to be on camera at all. But she's a little bit more comfortable. But yeah, that's why you always see me with my mom. I told y'all my circle is tight. Is it a circle? It's really not a circle. It's just really me and her. But don't get sad for me because I do have friends. I do. I just don't hang out with people. <laughs> like, I have friends. Don't get me wrong. I have them. I don't hang out with them as often as I choose to hang out with my mom. Because that's my best friend. Mm. Mm. And if she texts me one more time. <laughs> the next day. Good morning. Y'all. Put my window up. I am on my way. I'm on my way back to the recycling bin because y'all know I got all them Zara packages so I need to um, place them. Everybody is at the park. It is such a pretty, y'all, when I say it's a nice day, my mom didn't wear the right shoes because I told her we could have went walking. Um, 
no, they're using that to park. Is it voting time? Why is everybody parked? Why is there traffic up here? I'm thinking people at the park. People are not at the park. This is traffic. Y'all, why is my phone so, my camera so dark? Anyways, y'all, we had to take an alternate way because I don't understand. We've been in traffic all week long. Like, what is going on? But, um, yeah, so the plans for today is just to go there and then I'm gonna take back, y'all see I got the little outfit on, that Nike outfit. I'm gonna take that uh, jacket back because I'm not gonna wear it, I'm just not. Like on a day like today where it's warm outside, I could wear it today, but it would kind of be doing too much because it's so long and big and it's supposed to keep you warm. So I'm just like, you know what, I'm gonna take it back because I'm not gonna wear it. I kind of like the fit now. Once we get to the store, I'll show you the fit because it looks really cute. Um, but yeah, that's basically the plans for today. Just take some stuff back, go to the recycling bin, run to my storage, and that's about it. Can you see? Y'all, we at Target now. The post office line was ridiculous. We went to two post offices and they both were extremely long. Um, now we at Target. I was looking for them bottles again for my laundry. And yeah, I should have got it the day my mom got hers. Cause they are non-existent, which I pretty much figured it would be. That's the only reason why I came here to Target. So I think now we're just gonna browse around just so I'm not like wasting a trip. But I'm just so sad and just mad for real. Like I don't even wanna be here. I'm, I'm upset. Like how? What are you picking up? It's total nonsense. Okay, I don't even have a basket. That's how you know. I don't plan on like really shopping, really doing too much of anything. No basket, no purchase, right? Here I go. Y'all know every time I guess. <gasps> Y'all, they got this yellow long sleeve to go with the yellow bottoms. The bottoms that my mom says she did not like. What else? Why is it a little messy? Uh, more cargo skirts. I don't see that jacket. By first glance, I don't see too much of anything that I need. Y'all know I don't need anything. I'm done shopping. And I just took all that stuff, stuff back to Zara. Not all that stuff. It was like four items. Ooh, this denim jacket is cute. Here goes the jacket. This denim jacket is cute. I don't need another denim jacket. I really just came for them bottles that they do not have. And I'm sad. Y'all, I'm just thinking about it. Okay. All right. All right. I don't see nothing. Oh, they got some cargos. Look at these cargos. The brown ones. The brown ones are cute. The denim, not too much, but the brown, we could definitely do a haul, but, oh, hold on, let me show y'all the fit. Okay. It's like, it doesn't match, but it matches. You see the little whatever? And then I just got on some um, Crocs, and then my little hobo bag is giving very neutral. It's giving really, you know, I don't know. It's a look. Target ain't cheap. <gasps> they got a denim look. They got some outfits. Hold on. Let me show y'all. Okay, look. They got this denim halter top dress. Cute. This denim trench. Cute. If you go over there, let me zoom. Y'all see that dark denim look? She's cute. This stuff. No, I don't like those. For whatever reason, I'm so excited today. Like, y'all, I have some stuff in the works as to why I'm excited. I woke up early this morning. And, yeah, I'll tell y'all. I'll tell y'all if it went well um, once I hear the verdicts or whatever. I can't really tell y'all. But i'm excited and that is what has me like smiling today and then the sun is out it's hot it's like 60 some degrees it's like such a good day like i'm just excited like i don't know i don't i want to go walking today but my mom doesn't i told y'all she don't have on her walking walking shoes i can walk in crocs because i'm not really about to do too much y'all i am back home 
I'm about to start unwinding and getting in bed because I'm tired. Like, I really enjoyed my whole day out with my mother. What is going on? Okay, Zara. Um, I just finished eating me some Chinese. I got me some takeout. I was going to cook. I don't know what it is about this pasta that I've been wanting, y'all. But I'm like, you know what? I'm not going to cook no pasta. I've been craving some Chinese food. So, I'm about to water floss my teeth. Y'all, when I say I love this water flosser, it's a water pick water flosser. I love this down. So, yeah, I'm about to, because all that stuff be getting caught up in my teeth. I'm about to floss my teeth. Then brush brush my teeth. I think you're supposed to brush them floss. I don't know. I'm about to floss my teeth and then get into the um shower. This outfit turned out so cute, y'all. It turned out cute. What am I doing? I don't know. <laughs> I'm waiting for this water to get hot. So because I like to put hot water in here. So you know. I started to floss. Does anybody floss with um I think I seen one girl floss with mouthwash. Yeah, floss with mouthwash. And I was like, oh, okay, because I guess it, it puts like, you know, you're getting fluoride in your gums. I don't, I don't know. I don't really understand the concept, but I just be all, I be down for trying new things. But yeah, I'm about to get ready and unwind. I love y'all. And yeah, bye y'all. <laughs>